Hello. As you know, this world is filled with all kinds of problems. And they all come from sin. Our own sin and the sins of people around us sin in this world. And it hurts sometimes. Maybe we've been hurt in a way that we remember for many years. Or maybe we've caused that hurt to someone else. As real as those things are, and as real as that hurt and the pain and suffering are, what's more powerful is the forgiveness and the grace that we have in our Lord Jesus Christ. In St. Paul's letter to the Ephesians, he wrote about some of the challenges that people have in this life because of our sin and the way that we hurt one another with our words and, and actions. Paul also talked about the power of the gospel, what that means for us personally, what that means for our relationships. This week in our sermon, we're going to explore that a little bit in Ephesians chapter 5. And, and uh, Paul says this, he says, Be imitators of God, therefore, as dearly loved children, and live a life of love, just as Christ loved us and gave himself up for us. That's the key. That's the key to dealing with all the hurt and pain that, that we cause and others have done to us. It's to live a life of love, just as Jesus loved us first. He loved us by giving his life, by taking away our sin. And, and through that sacrifice, he brings us peace and joy and motivation to love others just as Christ loved us. Today, as you go through your life, and maybe you're tempted to think about some of those hurts or maybe feeling the guilt of hurt you've caused, remember the love of your Savior who paid for your sin and now strengthens you to live in that grace. May God help us all to do that. God bless your day.